so basically we have the cheese standards here in Canada which say that you can you need to make cheese from a certain amount of fresh milk and a certain percentage you can put ingredients in it. Now dye filtered milk is a product they do not use in processing in the US. They invented this product just to go around our rules and around our tariff system at the border. So it comes into Canada, at the border they call it an ingredient so they don't have to pay tariffs. So at the border it's an ingredient. Once it gets to the processing plant, it becomes milk. CFIA considers it milk. So they can put as much as they want into it. So on one side, one, one ministry calls it a, an ingredient to not pay tariffs. And then at the factory CFIA, it's milk and they can put as much as they want. How does this affect you as a farmer? Well, basically for the average farm in Canada, it's about $5,000 a year they're losing. Uh, $5,000 a month, sorry. On our farm, we milk uh, 320 cows, so it's about $30,000 a month that we're making less money because of this. Because the government is not applying a rule that exists and that processors know what the rules are and they agreed to those rules back in 2008. There was a table, the government sat, the processors, producers, everyone around the table, everyone agreed to these rules, and now they're not following them, the government's not applying the rules, and not punishing the people that are not going by the rules.